My name is Jeff Hauser, and I'm the instructor for the Embedded Systems Development Laboratory. Each student will select a project concept that is of interest to either them or their employer. My project was the data bubble. This is intended to be enclosed in solid epoxy. The data bubble was an idea that was given to me by a colleague. The idea was to measure the movement of water below the ocean. Typically, the projects involve little um, embedded processors, things like Arduinos, Teensies, Raspberry Pis. The main computer behind all of this is a Raspberry Pi. It is specifically running a version of the Raspbian called RetroPi. The RetroPi was a OS built specifically to be running uh, ROMs. The local controller, uh, I can pick whoever I want to be, select up, and then same with this one. And this is, like I said, an old Super Nintendo controller that I'm just wiring into. These small, low-cost microprocessors or computers and then a number of sensors. But the idea is that they take some of the coursework that they've done earlier in their career here at Hopkins and then they apply that to this project. By and large, the students are on their own to, uh, to develop the project. And my job is really just to monitor and to mentor. 